If you are trying to set up a new Roku, but you don't want to give them your payment information, maybe because of past data breaches, well, this video is for you. Number one, use a special signup link. The easiest option, it's to create your Roku account using a special link, and it will skip right past that payment screen. I've got the link on the screen. It's also in the description below. But a quick warning, don't go Googling all around for this link. There are a lot of Roku activation scams. Never pay to activate a Roku. It's 100% free. Just make sure that you're on Roku's official website and using the exact link that I provided. Number two today is to look for the skip option manually. If you've already started the setup and you're on the payment screen, scroll to the bottom. Sometimes there's an option to skip adding a payment method. I didn't see the skip option on my phone, but I did see it on a laptop browser while registering directly on Roku site and without using the special link. Number three, add it, then remove it. Your third option is to just go ahead, add the payment method temporarily, and then delete it once you're all set up. You can always manage or remove payment info anytime from Roku's account settings. Just remember that Roku doesn't need your card to activate the device. They ask for it to make it easier to start free trials and subscriptions using Roku Pay. But if you're like me, you find better streaming deals by signing up for services directly. Give this video a like if you found it helpful and get the latest streaming deals on michaelsavesdeals.com.